Hello everybody, Sinus111 here, and welcome back to more FTL Faster Than Light. We- I got the crap kicked out of us. In the last part, we were in this beacon. It was a- it was a nebula. It was an ion storm, and there was an automated scout there. It wreaked havoc on my ship, and look at that. Just this one bit of health! Wow, can there be a start any worse than this? I don't think so. Oh, it doesn't connect. Uh, I hope we run into some shops soon. Too dangerous. Oh, thank the lord. There is only one other ship at this beacon, and it is showing heavy damage. You receive a message on your console. Greetings, traveler. We were crippled by a band of pirates and are now forced to sell our remaining valuable equipment to acquire the necessary supplies to get home. Oh, you bet your sweet fifty I'm repairing. Ah, oh, just repairs and nothing else now. That's all I wanted. That was all I asked for. Long Ridge Beacon. You look like a military vessel. We're trying to get our get back to our homes alive. I am an engineer by trade and could try to improve your reactor if you have any extra supplies. Uh, sorry, I've been stumbling so much. I just cannot get over the fact that I've been massacred by that automated scout back at that nebula. As tempting as this looks, I'm gonna have to decline. You decide you have what supplies you have. Two Zoltan controlled sectors. I'm gonna go to the first one. You arrive in Zoltan space. From what you have heard, they anticipated the coming war and made preparations to hold their borders. I need some more scrap if I want to get the repairs necessary to be back in good shape. It appears the distress beacon is coming from the surface of a nearby moon. Your sensors are picking up a single life form. It's the same one from before. This time, I'm not going to take that risk. Uh, I need scrap. Bad. You jump into a debris field that used to be a Zoltan cruiser. Unfortunately, its NG escort takes you for the attacker and retaliates. They refuse all hails. And they have anti-drone drones too, so I can't use my combat drone. Guess I'll have to sit back and see how this plays out. disabled our shields, so... Oh, not enough power. Ah. Uh. Oh, hopefully I can, uh... Uh, I think I still need some more scrap before I can repair to full health. A Zoltan ship makes contact. The nature of the day is rotational. The fever is emaciated. The reason is, they've caught some nasty deep space dementia. Before you can consider finding help for them, they open fire. Oh man. Guess I gotta do what I gotta do best. Destroy everyone. They have Zoltan shields too, so you can't do anything special like hack or mind control, from what I have learned. Uh 
Uh-oh. Hole critical. I better take them out fast. Artillery beam, work your magic. No, I'm gonna have to go to the store and repair. I'm still in quite bad shape. A mantis crew here has hunkered down in the abdomen of a long dead space whale. The only way, presumably, for them to operate their black market trade without detection. Worth a look. I don't care what anything else is for, I just need repairs. Bad. And we're in. We're right in front of a... Pulsar. I forgot what it was. Before long a rebel ship happens to jump nearby, looks like you'll have to fight. I dare let those rebels get in the way of telling the Federation of what they're going up against. Why would I want to do such a thing? Uh, now I'm getting bombarded again. This is just a bear small. Uh, I'm gonna have to... They're, they're rebels, but I'm gonna have to accept. Oh, this is just abysmal. Uh, don't get me wrong, I am a master at this game, but it's been a while since I've played it. I'm getting out of here. You have encountered a refugee ship drifting in space. It looks as if it was fleeing the rebel advance and ran out of fuel. Its distress beacon is active, but you're not sure anyone is on board. I'll hail them. The vessel is relieved to hear from you. They are running low on supplies. They suggest a trade. Well, I want to save my drone parts for the Combat 1, so I'll plot politely decline. Oh, uh, uh, I'm still having flashbacks from when I was crippled by that scout back at the nebula from Sector 1. But I have to evade the rebels somehow. Okay, good. It's not on... Not going through an ion storm. Huh, they're gonna, they're gonna warn the rebel fleet. Well, I'm gonna have to remind you that I will not allow you to do that. Oh, it's still not enough power. I'm gonna upgrade my reactor once I defeat this ship. Down go your shields. Oh, it actually destroyed- Oh, no, no! Don't- The scout jumps away. It will certainly have informed the fleet of your position. You must get to the next sector as soon as possible. <sighs> Damn it! Wow, I am just doing abysmally at this. Why did I even jump into that nebula? This ship is... You stumble upon some Zoltan military vessels engaging in combat training. Their energy shields are impressive, but you note how quickly beam and ion weaponry take them down. Um, I got this ship after defeating the... 
second Rebel flagship at the Rebel Stronghold in a previous playthrough. But I'm starting to question whether it's really good or not. I'm starting to think that it's not the best ship to have if you're a beginner. I'm just gonna put that out there right now. <sighs> Another ion storm. You spy two pirate ships lurking in the nebula here. They remain unaware of your presence. You're able to get your scanners to at least identify their cargo. One is carrying the fuel supplies, the other the ammunition. They begin to drift away from each other in the storm. Let them leave. Sometimes discretion is the better part of valor. Here, it certainly is. I'm not going to question that logic. Well, I can jump instantaneously. Go to this other nebula beacon, which thankfully is not undergoing an ion storm. It's worrying that the rebels have presented, penetrated so deep into uncharted space. Even if it is only an un unmanned craft, it arms its weapons. You bet your sweet pippy I'm doing the same. Ugh, I'm, out, I'm out of fuel. You're kidding me. I'm out of fuel again. Oh, man. And I've been breached. And down you go. One missile, no fuel. Dang it. <sighs> you know what that means. A small ship arrives with a message. This automated ship will provide refueling services once a monetary exchange is complete. Complimentary amounts of fuel are available in emergencies only. Oh, I'm buying the five fuel thing for 20 scrap. Automated refueling complete. Thank you. Now I can exit this beacon. Although I may want to get some more repairs soon. Nothing new here. Boring. I'm gonna go to the civilian sector, since it's friendly. Welcome to a new sector. Get to the exit beacon and jump to the next sector before the pursuing rebels catch you. Or before your ship falls apart, or before you run out of fuel. Uh, yeah, that's how frustrating of a run I've had so far. But, I'm gonna leave things here. So, thanks everyone so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye.